understand what exactly a PCP is. A uh, post correspondent problem is a popular undecidable problem that was introduced by Amelion Post in the year 1946. Okay? And here we will be given two lists, two lists both containing n number of words. So both will be having equal number of words. And our aim is to find out the concatenation of these words in some sequence such that both the lists yield the same result. Okay. Uh, to get a better understanding, let us take some example. So, I need two lists, right? So, let me take the uh, list and let me name the list as A. First one as A and this will be the first word in my list A, A, A. Then the second word is B, B and third one is A, B, B. So, it is a combination of A and B. Okay. Then I will take another list. Let me name it as B and the first word I will take it as A, A, B second word as B A and third one third one as a single B. Okay. So, here as you can see the N is 3 and I have equal number of uh, words in both the list. Right. Now, what is our aim? See, let us read out again. The aim is to find out the concatenation of these words in some sequence such that both the list yield the same result. Okay. So, this is the index what I can give 1, 2 and 3 and this is 1, 2 and 3. So, what I need to do is I need to pick some words from the index from both the list. Okay. So, if I am picking 1 from A, I, sh I should pick the same uh, word with the index 1 from B. Okay. Such that I have to uh, make some uh, comparison from both the list, from both the list and it should be equal. Okay. So, what I will do? I will take, so I have to, I have to uh, take a sequence such that I should be able to get the uh, string which is concatenated by uh, taking this word, okay, it should be equal, okay. Now, let me take the first word as A, A. So, if I am taking A, A from the list A, I should take A, A, B, okay. So, this is uh, A part and let me take B part on the right side, okay. So, the first word what I took was A, A, right. So, this is the sequence what I am following. 1. Okay. So, A, A I have took. Obviously, I have to take the uh, same indexed word from B. So, the first uh, index is A, A, B. So, that is what I took. Right. Now, let me make a match. Is A, A equal to A, A, B? No. It is not equal. So, what I have to do? I have somehow, I have to make it equal. So, now, I will have to take some other word and concatenate it with whatever I, what I have already taken. Okay. To make it equal. Now, what I can take? I can take um, 2. If I take 2, then concatenate it with, it with the previous uh, selected word, then I will get A, A, B, B. And obviously, I have to take the same uh, indexed term on the right side. So, which is nothing but B, A, right. Okay. Now, is it equal? Again, it is not equal. Now, what I have to do? Again, I have to, uh, I have to try to uh, match this, right. Now, uh, what I can do is I can take 1 again. So, if I take 1, then I will get A, A here and uh, B, I will get A, A, B. Is it equal again? It is not equal. Okay. So, let me take 3 now. So, if I take 3, what will happen? I will get A, B, B and here I will get B. Okay. Now, if I match, see. Now, with this sequence, do, did I get uh, two string uh, from both left and right? Is it matching? Yes, it is matching, right? So, solution do exist, right? So, A, A, B, B, A, 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 B, B, which is equal to A, A, B, B, A, 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 B, B. So, using this sequence, okay, and uh, its concatenation, I was able to match uh, the, the sequence from both the list, right? Sequence of words from both the list. So, this is the solution for the 
uh, given problem this is the post correspondence problem uh, post correspondence solution for the given problem okay let us consider a few more example now let us consider one more example with the pcp and here i have two list which is named as x and y okay so this i can name th this is a word x1 x2 x3 uh, named it as uh, x1 x2 x3 based on the index value okay so this is the first word in the list x so i named it as x1 x2 and x3 or we can simply name it as 1 2 and 3 and this is y1 y2 and y3 okay so some of the key points i want to elaborate while selecting a word it is not necessary that i have to select all the words in the list okay so if i can get a match with the one or two words or one word itself then that is fine okay and it is also possible to select one word many times so i can repeat x1 for example as many times as, as i like to get the match done so ultimately i just want to get the uh, matches with the selected sequence from x and y uh, and uh, there is no restriction with respect to the m number of times each word can be selected okay and also there is no restriction or there is no condition that i have to select each and each and every word okay now to get a solution we have to perform some matching so which one i have to select first we have to uh, think properly and select okay so what i can select is the first word i can match here is um, i can match um, okay i can so this i can select so let me take two okay so if i take two then i have x1 here which is nothing but b a b replicated thrice which is nothing but b a b b b okay and on the right side i have to select okay so this is x2 right okay y2 so y2 would be yeah it's a simple b a now is there a match there is no match okay then uh, of course i have to select some other uh, elements and concatenate it with already selected two okay now to perform a match i can take one so that so i'll get okay so this is what i get b a uh, b replicated thrice concatenated with b okay then here i have to take obviously y1 itself so what do i get b a b cube so this becomes b a b b b okay now is there a match no i have an extra b here so again i have to select some other word and uh, concatenate it okay let me take one again so that is x1 again so what i will get i will get another b so this is the element and here obviously i have to take y1 so b cube so which is nothing but 3b okay is there a match now i have b a followed by how many b's here six b's and i here i have five b's okay still there is no match okay one more element i have to yeah uh, with one more element i should be able to get it okay let me take it as three if i take three x three here then what i will get i will get b a okay which i'll so this will be the string what obtained and uh, if i take y3 then it is a single a okay so do i have a match now yes b a followed by six b's and ending with a and here also i have b a followed by six b's and ending with a so this is the course uh, post corresponding solution for the given problem so uh, as per the question yes i have a solution and this is the solution okay and this is the sequence how i have to uh, select the string and there is also a possibility that uh, there can be more than one sequence which can get the solution okay and uh, th this is one of the solution what i got there can there is a possibility that i may have more than one sequence where i can perform a match okay and this is the solution okay now let us look into the next problem okay prove that uh, pcp with the two list yes x which is 0 1 1 and 1 and y 
uh, which is 0 0 1 0 1 1 0 and 1 1 has no solution okay let us uh, let us find or let us prove that this has no solution okay if you observe every element of x okay xi it is greater than yi okay if you take for example x1 x1 its length is 2 and uh, y1 is equal to okay so this is the other way right yeah and y1 it is 4 if you take x2 then the length is 1 whereas y2 it is 2 and x3 which is equal to 1 and y3 again it is 2 okay so if i get uh, uh, see for every x i or i element of both the list okay ith word of both the list its uh, length is more than the other right its length is more than the other so if this is the case then i can never get uh, two strings of equal length forget about the match if i cannot get uh, the subsequent strings on left and right with equal length then there is no possibility of getting the pcp solution so i can conclude uh, based on this condition i can conclude this uh, pcp has no solution so this is about post correspondence problem and uh, th these are some of the examples of it